This is a short video on how to change a die set on the Model 152 electric button machine. The first thing you want to do is remove the cover, which we've already done. Uh, the next thing you want to do is rotate or index the die set so one of these three screw holes is at 1 o'clock. To do this, you want to pull up the white safety switch on the back of the machine, turn the power on, and step on the foot pedal. Every time you step on it, it'll run up a cycle. And you want to step on it so it's one of the screw holes is at 1 o'clock, which it is now, and you want to push down on the white safety switch, turn the power off on the machine. The next thing you want to do is grab the wrench that's provided with the machine, loosen up all three screws, and you can leave the screws in the die set. Uh, a set of screws comes with every die set when you purchase it. Uh, you want to take one hand at 11 o'clock and one at 5. You want to lift up the die set and kind of feed it out at an angle. Set the die set down, hold your hand underneath the upper die, loosen up the screw. You do not need to remove this screw. Just loosen it up and it'll slide off the ramrod. You want to put that on top of the die set. The next dies that you want to put in, slide it up and if you notice, if I hang onto the outer ring, the center plug is not pushed all the way up onto the ramrod. So you want to put your finger in the center and push up on the center plug so they're touching right there. Align the half moon plate in the back of the die and tighten this screw down. Then grab the die set. Make sure one of the three screw holes is at one o'clock and you want to feed it in the same way you took it out, at an angle, and then just wiggle it and you'll feel it drop into place. Start all three screws, and then you can snug them down. These do not need to be tightened as much as the upper die does. Snug them down, then you can pull up the white safety switch, turn the power on, you successfully changed a die set in the machine.